Hey, this is Brett, and today I am super excited to go over this brand new 2024 Jeep Grand Cherokee Summit Reserve. This Grand Cherokee also has the Advanced ProTech Group 4, and it also has the Luxury Tech Group 5 as packages. This is a 23U Summit Reserve package. Hydro Blue is the color. And this one also has the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine. It's paired up with the eight speed automatic transmission, 293 horsepower. It's gonna get you 26 miles per gallon highway, 19 city for an average of 22 miles per gallon. And it can actually tow 6,200 pounds with the towing package on it. I'm gonna go all the way around in my videos. If you're not familiar with my videos, I do one of the most in-depth walk arounds of each vehicle I do. Uh, we also take a look at the original window stickers. So Stay tuned for that, it's right around the corner. This one does come with the LED headlamps, LED running lights and LED fog lamps. I'm gonna turn all those on at the end of the video so you can see just how bright they are. The Summit Reserve package gives you this kind of painted silver trim on the grill as well as on the grill surrounds. Seven slotted grill for all the continents that Jeep has been on and that Jeep logo is also the same silver paint. You get the silver trim piece down here and the silver around the fog light bezels. You do get the gloss black lower valence and the front bumper parking sensors in that lower valence. Hydro blue pearl coat. They just started putting this on the Grand Cherokee I think last year. Uh, really a good looking color. It's got a lot of metal flake in it. Uh, usually reserved for the Wranglers and um, the trucks I've seen it on as well but a lot of metal flake in there, really a good looking color. The Summit Reserve package comes with the 21 inch painted and uh, polished aluminum. That's actually the same kind of painted aluminum that's on the front there. These are 21 inch wheels and it has Continental cross contact tires. These are 275-45 R21s and they're an all season tire on there. Going down to the trim here, same silver along with the Grand Cherokee and American flag lettering. The silver goes on the mirror and up around the doors and then onto the roof rails there and on top of the door handles. Let's take a look at that original window sticker. Feel free to pause this. I'm not gonna go through everything, but most of it, 2024 Jeep Grand Cherokee Summit Reserve. This one is Hydro Blue Pro Coat, has Tapelo and black interior colors, Palermo leather seats. 3.6 V6, 24 valve VVT engine with electronic start stop and eight speed automatic transmission. Everything on your left here is your standard equipment. So the Jeep Wave, Quadra Track 2, electronic limited slip. Now the electronic limited slip is deleted over here. So you get a $400 credit. My guess is parts availability was to um, account for that. Select terrain system, traffic sign recognition, hands-free power lift gate, adaptive cruise control, active lane management, full speed collision warning plus, and surround view camera system, parallel and perpendicular park assist, blind spot and cross path detection, side distance warning, intersex, intersection collision assist system, pedestrian and cyclist emergency braking, active driving assist system, drowsy driver detection, automatic dimming, rear view mirror, quadra lift, air suspension, anti-lock four wheel disc brakes, electronic stability control, hill start, hill start assist, Tire pressure monitoring display, tire trailer tow package, semi-active damping, and rear seat object alert. So you can see just all the safety features that go into the standard equipment right there. Interior features include the Uconnect 5, the Apple CarPlay, Google Android Auto. Those are wireless now so that you don't have to fool around with any wires. You get the nine amplified speakers with subwoofer, heated seats, cooled seats, second row heated seats, and then the uh, power driver's seat with back massager, passenger seat with back massager, driver memory seat, and the ambient lighting in there, which is pretty cool. We'll check that out in a minute. And then you get the 20 by eight and a half inch wheels, which obviously this one doesn't have because we got to go to the um, optional equipment on here. Hydro Blue Pearl Coat is the first optional equipment. That's 595. The only color that is not charged 595 is bright white. So the, you get, don't get a charge with a bright white vehicle. 23U is the Summit Reserve package on this one. That is a $4,400 and $80 option. Front passenger interactive display, 21 inch by nine inch machine face painted aluminum wheels. 20 or 275, 45 R21 
all-season tires, Palermo leather seats, 19-speaker high-performance audio with the Macintosh sound system, active noise control system, 950-watt amplifier, vented rear seats, deluxe headliner, Palermo leather door trim. So this advanced ProTech Group 4 is a $2,800, $2,865 60, $2, option. Gives you heads-up display, night vision with pedestrian and animal detection, and rear view auto dimming digital display. Now that system right there, especially in Wisconsin for deer, is a huge thing. Um, that's really cool. Luxury Tech Group 5 is 905 bucks and gives you the manual second row shades. Uh, this one does have the conventional differential rear axle. 75,600 is your MSRP on this one to get your summit price in the upper right hand part of the screen and linked in the description below is a link to our website. Click that and uh, you can get all the rebates and incentives on this particular Jeep if it's still available. Three year 36 bumper to bumper and five year 60 powertrain. Your fuel economy is right there, 26 highway, 19 city, 22 average. And then the safety rating is five stars up and down the board, not rated for rollover. So they don't have the overall score there, but Jeep's historically very safe um, vehicles. We'll get to that interior in just a second. Four wheel disc brakes on the Grand Cherokees coming around to the back. You get that silver trim on the exhaust tips as well as on the rear trim piece there on the bumper. There is your towing package with the receiver hitch, four pin and seven pin wiring. Remember 6,200 pounds uh, towing capacity on this Jeep. You get the gloss black on the trim back here, the LED tail lamps, which they look really good. Very distinctive uh, back end on these vehicles. So when you're driving behind them, you definitely know you're behind a Grand Cherokee. Here's the cover for that receiver hitch. I take it off for the video so I can show you. Uh, still has the Berber floor mat inside the plastic here. There is the subwoofer part of that Macintosh 19 speaker system. And then you get all the different generations of Grand Cherokees on that window silhouette there. That looks pretty good. Those seats do fold down nice and flat. You also get a Jeep climbing up the uh, side of your window over here. And then this button gets that gate down. Full size spare tire when you get the trailer tow package. And then to get this gate down, you press that button. It'll beep at you three times and then begin its descent. I don't know if you saw, but there's also speakers on the inside of the doors there. So that's um, part of that 19 speaker system. Capless fuel fill on all the Grand Cherokees. Love that feature, never get gas on your hands again. And coming down the rest of the side of the vehicle, you get the blind spot, heated mirrors, directional signals, does have the enter and go system. If you get the three lines there, you just have to put your hand in there. It'll automatically unlock take a quick look at the back seats. So the Summit Reserve 23U package makes these back seats heated and cooled. Obviously not cooled or heated in the middle, but on the outboard side, driver and passenger side, uh, those seats are heated. That one's actually reclined. You can see how much they recline on there. So that's pretty cool. Berber floor mats back here. You get 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in, as well as two USBs, two USB-Cs, heated cooled seat buttons and rear air controls. You get the latch child safety system with a cover there. Keeps you from uh, knocking your back into these bars here, which is pretty nice. And it hides them nicely as well. And then these seats do fold down and you can see just how nice and flat they go. You get these sun shades, which is part of the ProTech 5 package. Um, you know, basically that's the only thing on that package, which is a really nice feature, don't get me wrong. Uh, to protect whoever's back here from the sun on long trips. That's a great feature. I wish my van had that. $905, not so sure. Um, you get the Palermo leather on the doors there, the wood grain trim, and then child safety locks on the back doors as well. Let's check out that interior. Now, let me know in the comments section below uh, what you think that this color looks like, and uh, then I'll let you know what I think it looks like but it's a, definitely a tan leather. You get the black piping on the sides there, both these seats heated, cooled, and memory, and uh, massaging. The Berber floor mat up front, auto headlamps, power telescopic and tilt steering wheel. You get the wood grain trim, the nice black, gloss black on there as well. There's your wood grain trim going right into the door. Memory driver seat, there's your controls for that massaging seat. You get the Palermo leather trim on the door there and the black surround on the 
instrument cluster there. And then these mirrors do power fold in. You gotta turn that knob down and then they go back out. And then the Macintosh premium audio system. Let's hop inside, check out the instrument cluster radio and everything that this one has to offer in the interior. I'm gonna try and make this go fast. Um, I've got guys waiting on me. So digital speedometer on that 12 inch instrument cluster, you get a compass outside temp display. Now, if yours has the night vision, you're gonna get this road with the half moon on there or the crescent moon or I don't know. I don't know my moon phases, but um, you're gonna get that if it has the night vision. And that's uh, with that advanced ProTech 4 package, advanced ProTech group four. So that's how you get the night vision. Also the heads up display. It's kind of dim right now, but uh, you can see it kind of right. It's like right there in the windshield. So anyway, it's a digital speedometer and you can adjust that through the instrument cluster here. The cool thing with this instrument cluster is if you press this different pane button, you get all your different screens that you can have and you can also change these. So if it's got an up and down arrow, you can change what's displayed there. So you got miles per gallon, your tire pressures, oil percentage, battery voltage, um, oil pressure, uh, water temperature, trans temp, uh, more water temperature. Anyways, you can change all those to read, you know, basically whatever you want. So really a lot of cool stuff you can do with this instrument cluster. We could do a whole video on that. Comes with the heated leather wrapped wood grain trim, black trimmed steering wheel. This is my, in my opinion, the best looking steering wheel I've ever seen. Really nice um, trim on there, how they did the wood grain with the black and the leather on these steering wheels. I've, I've said it before in my Wrangler videos, it's like a really soft touch, but a firm leather. So definitely a nice feel to it. Cruise controls, adaptive cruise controls, Bluetooth and information center controls. And there's that button to change that center console. You get the audio controls on the back as well as the paddle shifters. This one has the Uconnect 5 10.1 inch radio. It's supposed to be five times faster than the Uconnect 4, or the old version of the Uconnect system. There is the factory navigation system. You get AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities, as well as Bluetooth, USB, and AUX hookups, and Alexa. You get your comfort controls or climate controls right here, including your dual climate controls. Not sure. There we go. You get your heated and cooled seat buttons as well. And then you get your massaging seats, which are pretty sweet. Um, I think the vehicle's got to be on for those to be working, but you can extend, you can do the waterfall, lower back, extend, lower, extend, and then the rock climb for the driver or passenger side. And then uh, you can control the rear climate controls as well. Here are all your different apps. Now I'm not going to go through everything. Uh, we will go through some of the stuff, but just not everything because there's too much and this video would go way too long. There are your massaging seats. And then basically these are just links to all the different options down there. You get your nav, your phone, Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, the ambient lighting. Now that's really cool. So you can see if you look underneath the door trim there, see how it's kind of blue? It's because the blue is selected. Now if I turn that to red, see how that changes? Do yellow, white, and aqua. I'm pretty sure you could probably Customize your colors there, maybe. Um, but anyways, you can change all that. And then the bottom changes the floor color. You can see there. So however you wanna set that up, it's a pretty cool system. Anyways, let's go back to apps here. You get your front camera off-road pages, which I will show you, cause those are really cool, as well as the surround view camera. There's your system and other. So the surround view camera, you can see it gives you the surround view and then you can select all your other cameras. So you get a narrow view of the back, a wide view of the back, a wide view of the front, a narrow view of the front, and then the actual uh, tow camera to hook up your camper trailer or boat. And you get the grid lines on there and then you can zoom in on that hitch to get hooked up the first time every time. You also get your off-road camera. Those wheel marks are dynamic. So as you turn that steering wheel, it's kind of showing you where you're going to go in the future. I don't know if you'd want to really take your summit reserve off-roading, but just in case you didn't want to hit any rocks and wreck those nice 21 inch painted and polished aluminum wheels, um, 
that allows you to see where you're going in front of you so you're not going to do that and uh, then we have the off-road pages which are right here and the off-road pages give you your steering angle your transfer case rear axle locker if they're locked or not and then at steering angle as i turn that steering wheel you can see that angle changes and actually watch the wheels up top they do change as well so that's pretty cool you have your latitude longitude and altitude on there as well different accessory gauges pitch and roll and select terrain on here so that's part of the quadra track 2 system right down here you got sand mud snow auto sport and rock so if i put it in the sport you'll actually go onto a racetrack there a drag strip you got snow sand and mud you can see those change as you do that it also changes all the vehicle dynamics um, when you go into those different modes and you can see the uh quadra track or the quadra lift system is actually changing for those road conditions it does have off-road mode one off-road mode two normal view or normal height and then enter exit and then a lowered um for a highway driving and that's basically everything on the radio wireless cell phone charge pad two usbs two usb c's and an aux jack hdmi uh, passenger hookup and what's that for that's for the passenger screen which is right there so you can control radio controls right there I, you can also hook up like a, a video game system or a dvd player and watch movies right over there you can't do it on here but you can do it over there and that's what that hdmi is for you turn that screen on with that right there this is your perpendicular and parallel park assist parking sensors hazard light stability control there's your lane keep assist and your start stop capabilities uh, down here are once again are your quadra track 2 system controls your 8-speed automatic transmission your quadra lift system You can actually lower that yourself right there um, And it'll actually be lowering the vehicle. I don't know if you can see that So it lowers the front then the back there we go Kind of hard to see anyways Downhill assist control, that's a neutral setting for flat towing and then four-wheel drive low. You can see normal ride height achieved once it's done. You get your keyless entry with a remote start and power lift gate on there. You also get a holder for your key fob right there. Also note the gloss black trim that goes all the way around the center console here. Looks really good. And that gloss black goes around the passenger radio. Just a really nice color combination on this vehicle. And then you get the panoramic sunroof, second row fixed, power sunroof in the front, as well as the power sunshade. And then you get map lights, assist and SOS buttons, sunroof and sunshade controls. Get the nice gloss black trim up there as well. And then you get the sunglass holder there, home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lane systems. And you also get the suede headliner, which is pretty nice as well. And then you get your rear view mirror camera. So this is actually a video display of what's going on behind you. You can turn that off. You can also raise it, lower it, brighten it, or dim it. All right, let's start it up, take a look under the hood, and just uh, check out all those LED lights in the front, as promised. I know it's kind of a long video, but this has got a lot of options, so definitely uh, want to go through all of it. You can see the Macintosh lights up once you turn the vehicle on. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video you've gotten a really good idea of the overall look, styling, color, and options on this vehicle. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Want to see something else? Want, to, want me to demo something else? Let me know. Always open for more video ideas. Under the hood we have the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine. Engine bay is very clean obviously. Um, brand new vehicle. So you get the cover on the 3.6 when you get the Summit and Summit Reserve package. Not sure why they do that on just those two vehicles, but if I just did a Limited and it's definitely not on there in the Limited, so that's interesting to know. They do have shocks to keep that hood up. There's your um, emission sticker. Everything you need to know is labeled in yellow, the washing, washer fluid, coolant, oil, where to put it in the oil. Everything else is for a technician. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much everything. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Let's do a final walk around here with all those lights on. I really like that they've made all these uh, vehicles LEDs now and you can see just how nice and bright they are. And just look how far off they go. So it's definitely a, a good angle for those lights to brighten up everything in its path. 
Like I said, the LED lights in back are very distinctive. You can definitely tell when you're following a Grand Cherokee. And to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, Grand Cherokees, Cherokees, Wagoneers, Grand Wagoneers, Compasses, Renegades, you name it, we gotta go to the website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at summitauto.com. If you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto, click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle walkarounds on YouTube. 9,000 videos and counting, just hit 9,000 the other day. Super excited about that. And to see, in fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to all the Grand Cherokee videos I've ever done in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to help you with this brand new 2024 Jeep Grand Cherokee Summit Reserve 23U package with the Advanced Pro Tech 4 package and the Luxury Tech 5 group in Hydro Blue Pearl Co. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.